Hello guys, welcome back to another video at Moorhead Homestead. Before we begin, please like, subscribe, and ring that notification bell. Um, I think the goats are a little hungry. We're going to feed them. And then we got, hold up. What? Then we got Kevin and Rachel from Hen Heights Farm coming over. And they're going to get some railroad ties off of me. Um, but I'm not going to tell you what they're going to do with them. You got to go check out his channel if you guys haven't. And uh, But... It's going to be really, really stinking cool, and hopefully uh, he'll have me over one day and I'll get to uh, use them as well. What up, MJ? MJ? Get out of there, MJ. You probably can't see him on the camera because he's black and honey shirts. Oh, uh, blending in with you? Yeah. Okay, no, he's not. Then uh, he won't blend in with me. Oh. Here he is. <laughs> now there's Thor. He is the bam most bam. carefree cat you'll ever find in you, your life. You hold him however you want. However you want. He just kind of lays there. He's purring like want, this. I want to get. He's fine, buddy. Oh. Hunter. Tell everybody about your day. Um, we played a football game. And? We lost. Did you try hard though? Yeah. I got a bunch of yards though. Can I you show got a bunch you? of yards? Can I show them something How many really yards funny? Do you think you got? About 35. 35? You got more than that. 45,000. <laughs> nice. Look. All right, we'll catch you all when um, Kevin and Rachel get here. Alrighty guys, well Kevin and Rachel finally showed up as promised um, to get these ties for that sweet deal they're doing. But like I said, you'll have to go check them out to figure out what they're doing with all these. But it's going to be super cool and I uh, look forward to uh, watching it. So uh, they're here, he's got the tractor over there and yeah. Rachel stepped up and she brought the big old flatbed here. Beast. Beast <laughs> truck. And we're going to see just how many of these railroad ties we can get on it. How many do you think we can fit on that truck? You think we can fit all these on there? Man, they're heavy. They are way heavy. That's why we brought the tractor. But I think you're going to try. We're going to try. <laughs> yeah, so we'll see. So that, <laughs> that front end is really going to be walking on the way back yeah. when you get all that weight on the back, but it should be a good time. Yeah, I don't know. That might be too many. We'll see. Uh -oh. You're always welcome to take two loads or whatever, so we'll, if we're not here, we'll so see if I will help you out. Yeah, there we go. All right, well, we're going to get started. We're going to get the tractor unloaded and see how many we can put on there find out what we're gonna do this isn't gonna be on the hidden heights channel this is actually gonna be on the untamed outdoors channel uh, we're making a video today on hidden heights farm channel because well we're gonna be doing all this work on hidden heights farm channel but it's actually for our new channel untamed outdoors yeah so they do more my style of stuff on there I mean we do some homestead <laughs> homestead and stuff but he does a lot of sweet sweet stuff on untamed outdoors so go check that out and uh, like subscribe and ring his bell all right we're gonna get started
right, y'all, so we just got loaded up. How many do you think we was able to get? Oh, watch out, sissy. There's a lacquer <laughs> in your head. Huh? <laughs> so how many of y'all think we were able to get on the back of this old flatbed? Look, Daddy, show, show, show this on camera. <laughs> Where is it? it it landed, it bounced on your right there and it bounced on there. <laughs> so, if my calculations are correct, I think I got mixed up. About 30 or 31 on here. So, how much weight is that? You think? Yeah, how much weight is that? That's uh, they weigh 2,000 pounds or 200 pounds. 6, I'm pretty sure those are supposed to be a little U shape. No, the uh, shocks. shocks suspension. I think it'll work. You don't got to Sissy, you're like getting stepped on, you're getting kicked, you're getting worms through in your hair. I think that was a lizard tail, wasn't it? You got stung by a wasp at school the other day. Oh no. Yeah, the red wasp protector. Ow. God. You gonna be able to drive this back home? We'll see. <laughs> We're gonna say a prayer. <laughs> yeah, we'll see. Maybe I should drive the big truck and you can drive I'll the I'll thank you on camera. <laughs> Ooh. You, I, you I dare you to. You I want to spin for everybody to see? Good. Throw it on mama. <laughs> I'll pay you $20 to eat it. Whoa. She's got $20. I saw it. If you eat it, she'll give it to you. <laughs> I'll pay you 20 bucks. Bro, are you actually thinking about it? I'm not. You're not? <laughs> all right, guys. We got them all loaded up, strapped down. Um... We did the old uh, flip test here, so they're not going anywhere since we flipped flip them straps. Chain. It's it can't flip. I mean, it is. No, you can't. I don't know if you can get one more crank on that. I hope I can get that thing loose. So we got 31 of these on here. Rachel's gonna have so much fun driving this home, but no, these old Chevys, I think they'll they'll do just fine. But uh, I like to thank all you guys for tuning in today on today's video. If you guys have not checked out Kevin at Hidden Heights Farm, and Go check out his other channel at Untamed Outdoors, correct? Yes, and we want to tell you, thank you for these railroad ties. Like I just said on one of our videos on our channel, is we've been looking for these things for months, and we haven't been able to find them anywhere locally. Bo said, hey, come over, help yourself to however many you need, and he had like 35 of these things, and the project we're doing, it's going to work out great. So thank you so much. Hey, no problem. Glad we could help. Um, that's kind of, these homestead channels is what we do. We just help each other out. Somebody needs something. I mean, they were just sitting there, so come grab them. <laughs> <laughs> so we might need something later on down the Never road and, and they may have it so just like to uh encourage you guys to go check out check out kevin at hen heights farm and untamed outdoors if you like um outdoor adventures and loud stuff loud stuff <laughs> yeah you teach me all these words i gotta say yeah. to, you know youtube friendly youtube friendly so go check out them and i'll leave an i card to both channels um in one of those corners i always get confused yeah me too and um if you like it which i'm sure you will most of you guys are probably already subbed to kevin at hidden heights farm but if you're not go check them out and tell them where at homestead sent you thank you guys oh shoot there ain't no thing i don't think it's just put a few more on there Alrighty guys, what well, is the next day? Oh, hold on. Yeah, so it's the next day um, after Kevin came and got those railroad ties. And I'm gonna do something that I haven't done yet. Um, we normally let the chickens out, which I'm gonna let the chickens out. But I'm just gonna leave this door open and let the chickens, the turkey, everything kind of just if it wants to come out and graze, it can come out and graze type day. So I'm going to prop this door open with something here. And let's just hope that they all come back in here this evening to roost. So they should, they know. They know they roost, so they should come back, hopefully. Got a hen fixing to come out.
she's kind of unsure. Go get some water, dude. You got water over there, dude. All right, well, we'll keep an eye on these and see if they come out later. Let's see, we already have a, a few um, chicken out there um, doing a little grazing. Got the babies over there. Snowflake. What's up, MJ? What's my goats doing, huh? What's my goats doing? Oh, Lucy. How's Lucy? Man, looks totally different here with just a few railroad ties. Now, I'm really surprised we didn't see any snakes underneath here. A um, ton of worms, a couple lizards, but no snakes. I am so shocked. I thought for sure we was going to get... Um, bull snake something like that uh maybe even a copperhead or something up in there but uh thankfully nothing so that's pretty good news thor you promise not to chase any turkey do you promise not to chase any turkey all right i'm gonna trust you i'm gonna trust you yeah i'm gonna trust you but you can't chase them turkeys okay all right all right, guys, well, we'd like to thank you for clicking on this video. If you like this video, smash that like button. If you guys have not subscribed to our channel, Add More at Homestead, please subscribe on your way out or click another video and watch it as well, entering that notification bell. Um, I'll let you know in the next video how they did, if they went back to roost, all that jazz. Um, but once again, if you have not subscribed to Kevin at Hidden Heights or his other channel, Untamed Outdoors, please do so now. There's a link in the description below thanks everybody or in the description below can't put another i card in the description below so go check them out um if you like them subscribe i'm sure you will they do a lot of the same stuff as we do here on the farm but they have a ton more animals they have like 50 something goats i believe rachel said now so uh yeah a lot more upkeep and all that jazz so just having a few i can say it is work i cannot imagine having 50 of them so go check them out, see what you think, tell them where at Homestead sent you, and until next time, God bless.